Ooh, sword. <laughs> Hey, love, lovey, and Zeta Sister Guardian. Hopefully, you're having a great day. I'm having a great day. We're back today, actually, in a new game that's not actually fully out yet, but we're going to talk about that. So, let's see the normal video intro stuff. If you haven't already, please make sure you smash, smash, smash the love like button and do the same thing with the subscribe button. I would greatly appreciate it. It helps me out a lot. And our wonderful plug of the day is Alpha. Thank you for the love and support, Alpha. I greatly appreciate it. So, so, what this game is, is this is Loot Quest. So, basically, you join on in the game, you go up to the bad guys. And you hit the bad guys with your sword. You can actually dodge. And you actually have a chance to get a critical every time you strike an opponent. Your opponents give you little gems. Which gems can be used to buy all kinds of things. And you have a chance every time you kill a mob to get a sword. So the swords can actually be combined and evolved into better versions. So right now in the state of the game. They do not have pets added. They will be adding that in. They do have leaderboards currently out. And we do have a little cell area, so when you get your stuff, you just run over here and hit sell. There is an auto sell when your stuff gets full. And we also have a shop, so coins are currently being used to buy storage. They have they have several different storage options, and there will be more in further zones. So this is kind of like some of the other games. However, I want to bring your attention to something. These game passes are ridiculously cheap. 50% walk speed infinite gem storage yeah all these prices for all this stuff is super super cheap and you're like sister if the game's not fully done yet why are you telling us about it well i'm telling you all about it because if my lovely plebs you manage to get to level 45 when the game is fully released they will be wiping everyone's data however if you reached 45 during the testing phase which is it's in pre-alpha testing right now still you will get a special item so I wanted to bring this to y'all because I wanted to give y'all a chance to get a super, super nice item and kind of come in and get a flavor for the game. The devs are in game, so if you want to give them feedback on anything that's going on, a lot of it is already very cleanly polished and already ready to go. So that way you actually can have an opportunity to look at different stuff. And the game actually does prompt you. It does have cinematics. I um, logged into the game and did not have my recording software on, so I missed the cinematic. So there's actually a cinematic, and we did actually level up the sword, but we're going to evolve it. So we get to evolve it into an iron sword, so it is evolved. And it is slightly better than the steel sword I got dropped. We're going to go ahead and equip that. There is a pets tab, we have multi-delete, they also have equip best. So they're working on several different options. There's a teleport feature when you unlock the different areas, that's free. They also have an index, currently the index is just for forest of you know, percentiles of weapons dropped. And I know all of y'all are like, sister, this sounds a lot like another game I know. All done. All done. So, big difference in this is this is a massive zone. So, there's two of us, three of us, wandering around in this, just the starting area, and there's plenty of mobs to kill. I don't feel like I'm being forced to, like, compete for mobs. I can go over to a group of mobs I want and go fight them and not have to compete with, you know, 20 other people all killing the same stuff there are harder mobs in each zone i'm about to die to one because he won't leave me alone go away and i do like this feature that you can actually dodge if you are quick enough or not or i can ragdoll to the ground you do have your own personal level which affects your health which is actually super super nice and some of the other features that will be added in prior to the release of the game they'll be adding in trading i already talked about them adding in pets how they're going to be doing basically more unique features is they're going to have login points. So there's actually going to be a shop where you can get bonuses, buffs, and game passes and other perks just by logging in once a day. So it's kind of like a daily reward, but something that you can save up for and is easily obtainable as long as you just get on once a day. So this game's not going to require a whole lot of grinding. And I have played this game before. Like, I had them wipe my account, and it was pretty easy for me to get up to level 35. It's it's not a super long, hard, grindy game. Not that difficult. Something else that they're going to be adding is skills. It'll be basically a drop that every time you defeat, like, a boss, because there is zone bosses. So for, like, the first area we have over here, um, this boss. 
He's right there. He does a lot of damage. I really don't want to go play with him because he's going to kill me. And I'm not going to like that. But there'll be like a main skill and a rare skill buffing and like buffing your attacks, player buffs, regen, healing, that kind of stuff. So it's going to have a little bit more of an RPG element to it compared to some other games. So, and it's going to be a whole lot less collecting rare items to combine them into stuff, which I actually really like. Uh, they're also going to have a couple other forms of currency from what I've been told. And they will be having item reforging. I'm not really sure what that is going to be entailing, so, but I am curious. I do like the fact that you, it does prompt a sell button, and it's actually pretty clean. I really haven't had any issues in this game. They've actually, the current version that they have out for everyone to test and play on has been very smooth. So every time they've been releasing basically updates for the testers to work through, we've been able to get to it. So if you're interested in playing this game, I will leave in the lovely comments, not comments, the description. I'll leave a game link for y'all. I do know that there is two main developers working on this. They do have, you know, scripters and a few other people doing some other stuff to help them out. Ooh, I got a platinum sword. That one is rare. So it is two people working on this frantically. And I'm, I mean, I've been enjoying it. So, oh, we got a, ooh, nice. I do know as you combine these up further, uh, you can actually get some pretty sick, like, animations with them. So they actually do upgrade really, really nice. I'm going to increase my backpack soon. So, but guys, basically you have to get to level 45 before they fully release. I don't have a fully release date for y'all, but I did want to give y'all a chance to get a awesome item. Uh, the devs are on, it's Dog Warrior and Azul, so they're always on, and usually if there's a problem or anything, be like, hey, hey, or if you want to talk about the game, you can. There's several other players that have been playing for a long time, so this is, this is, I mean, I've had a lot of fun just kind of coming in and grinding the game and kind of watching the development of this. I kind of wanted to show it off and basically be like, hey, guys, 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 I got, I got a special opportunity for everybody, so... And, of course, I probably will be playing this game a lot. So, yeah. But they do have, like, the next area for us to go to is that lovely, lovely desert area. So make sure that, you know, you're coming in, you're playing the game, and you do get to keep these. If you buy the game passes in pre-alpha, so if you buy these so that you can get all the way to the end, get all the way, you know, up to 45 so you can get that special item, your game passes will carry over when they do the character wipes for everybody. So the game passes will not be wiped from your account. So if you were like, sister, this game looks great, then definitely come and check it out. It definitely will be something worthwhile. Um, I am I am very interested in playing this. So I've got a few plebs here. Wizard's a little more of a beginner. Where's Buzz? Yes, and Buzz has that. Uh, one other thing I do want to mention, for those of you that make it to this part of the video, because I always like it when y'all make it to the end, there is actually secret weapons. So if you manage to acquire a secret weapon during the testing phases, you will keep it when the game releases. So that's another reason to come on in, give them a test, play through it a little bit. Of course, make sure if you can join their Discord, they always have updates of stuff that they put out and stuff like that. So, but I am super excited for this game. Buzz, aren't you excited? Buzz, aren't you? Yes, Buzz is wearing merch, so. <laughs> but guys, thank you for making it this part of the video. I greatly appreciate it. Hopefully, y'all are interested in the game. I am super excited for this when it comes out. Definitely be something I will be wanting to play. And, uh, yeah. So. I'll see y'all next time. Bye! Before we go, guys, I want to give a big shout-out to my lovely knights of the YouTube channel. I greatly appreciate all y'all's support. Y'all are amazing. And a big shout-out to my Emerald Knights. Thank you so much for the love and support. See y'all next time.